beautiful snowy day. But I haven't painted it yet, so we're all going to paint it together. Isn't that fun? Um, <laughs> I think you'll uh, like this painting. Normally, uh, I give a devotion, but I think we have to start painting the picture first, so you won't know what I'm talking about. Uh, <laughs> Everybody take your painting, uh, your canvas off. I put masking tape around here. That's going to be the border of your painting. But the thing is, I don't want you to get paint underneath the masking tape. So take your finger and make sure that it's really a tight seal on that. Mountains and a lake in front. So that's what we're going to try and do. So uh, I want you to imagine your painting just with me, not the whole class. Sometimes people, they watch me paint, and then they watch their neighbor paint, and then they watch their other neighbor paint, and then they get way behind, okay? So it's just you and me, and when I just follow the leader... Some of the liquid white. Ooh, that's pretty. Is that beautiful? Okay, not <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm starting here and I'm pulling over there. I'm starting over here, pull over there. Look at this, nice long strokes. Well, some people are going to go like this. No, don't <coughs> do that. Long strokes, sun all across there. Wait, don't paint yet, just watch me. I'm going to try and get it over the masking tape over here. Ooh, so fun. Look at that, I like that dark over there. Yes. Look, it's darker up here. Lighter, lighter, lighter. Huh? And, uh, the reason I've got a little darker right in here. I, I, I have a little darker right in there just because I'm going to put a cloud there. And the more contrast you get in your picture, a white cloud over a dark sky, it'll show up more. So I'm just, I'm kind of giving it a little kind of a streak in there. I can streak it a little bit more. This is so nice. That's a serious one. Woo, you got <laughs> Yeah, yes. <laughs> Get that corner right here at the top of that mountain. Watch how I do this. I'm going to try and put this brush like this, and I'm going to, I'm going to pull the mountain. Everything on this side of the mountain, I'm going to pull that way. Everything on this side of the mountain, I pull this way. So you're all, you're all looking the, up here. The very top of the mountain, you're saying? Uh, yeah, from the top of the mountain, it goes that way. This top of the mountain, it goes this way. Okay. That's a no-brainer. Look at this. I just, I'm going to put my brush kind of flat. Look at, I, see how I'm holding it so that's that's kind of, I can't, I don't want to blur that top of the mountain, but look at this. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go up to the top of this one. Look at this, top of this one. Oh. Look at this, top of this one. Make that sound. Ooh. Okay, so that's going that way. Now watch this. Now I'm going to get this corner up there. See the top of the brush is right there. I'm just going to pull down a little bit on that side. Look at that. Can you see the mountain range coming? Yes. Yes. <laughs> All the way over the end. I'm going to pull this. Now I'm going to feather this here a little. Oh, oh my God. Your hands are so clean already. <laughs> okay. You did it right. Everybody, I need uh, that. Really nice. <laughs> nice. That looks really clean. Good job. Good job. Over here, right? right. Yes, we have. Uh, Where would you like them? Okay. Here. Uh, you, you don't want to go like this. Start there and go down. No. 
Not allowed. Spoiler. Don't do that. Spoiler. Okay, I'll do it. I'll do it, and then you can do it. But let me just say that in painting, less is more. Amen. That's the amazing. less you do might be the better it is. Here we go. Now, you're wondering, how can I ever make that go straight up and down? If anything, don't even use your brush. But here we go. I'm going to hold, I'm just going to use, look at this, the top 10 uh, bristles here. Woo! <laughs> okay, watch this. Now I'm, I'm going to go in there. I'm not going to use this part of the brush. I'm going to use just that part of the brush. So I'm going to I'm going to paint with it just like this, and just using those top bristles. Look at this. I'm just going to. In fact, if you didn't want to do this, you wouldn't even have to do it. But look at that. You see, it's just oh, that's okay. I want this to be really skinny. Look at that. It's really skinny down there in the bottom. Look at this. Really, now when I'm over here, I'm going to pull it up a bit more. <laughs> now I'm going to switch my brush from being using that. I'm going to make I'm going to make this fit in the curvature, like this. And I'm just going to pull straight up. Oh, makes you feel so good. Do you see it coming? Yep. Okay. Don't go. Don't start. Wait. 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 Uh, I'm good. Some people, they, they start going lower and lower with this, and they end up with all mucked up. Just go right into that one line, go like it straight up. Whoa. Wouldn't it be good if some red came out? Oh. <laughs> good. Okay, now that is the skinniest one there's ever been in the world, right? Looks like that. Okay. I'm going to pull it straight up. I am. But look at this. You see this? There's none in there. Huh? There's a lot there, none, halfway. Just kind of break it up a bit. You don't need to make it, some people make it like a like a curtain across the sky. Make it irregularly irregular. Say that. Irregularly, irregularly irregular. Okay. You got it. Okay. So I'm just kind of pulling up like this. And I'm going to keep going a little bit more. Do it. Okay, we'll give up. Yes. Everybody do that. So you've got some bristle, <coughs> some uh, Excuse me. stuff there. Look at this. On the bristles, I've, I've actually got little globs on it, so that, that might be individual um, bushes. Okay, I'm going to hold it this way, flat across this way. Are you with me?